What's up, guys? Nick Borman here of wagertalk.com with a free preview for this week's RBC Heritage. As always, you can head on, head on over my page at wagertalk.com to get this week's complete tournament pack. 29 bucks includes all outright leaderboard and head-to-head matchups for the week, hoping to rebound from a disappointing week last week at the Masters. And I really love uh, this matchup this week. You can find this one at DraftKings, and that's Emiliano Grillo over Lucas Glover. Grillo is a steady second-tier player and always seems to find himself right in the thick of things in some of these smaller tournaments. He does have a few slip-ups this year, but those came at the difficult venues. He missed the cut at the Players, the Genesis, and the Farmers, but he's really been rock-solid in his other starts. He's made the cut in 13 of 17 events overall this year, and he has seven top 25 finishes, including a tie for six in his last start uh, at Corrales Punta Cana. On the season, he ranks number 12 strokes gained off the tee and number 40 strokes gained approach while owning the 23rd best scoring average on tour. This is only his third start at Harbor Town. He did miss the cut here last year, but I'm not putting a lot into that. That was the second event of the COVID restart, so it was a weird time for everybody, so don't worry about that too much. Uh, His previous two starts here were tied for 33rd and tied for 16th. Lucas Glover has been much more inconsistent this season. He's made 11 cuts and 16 starts, but since the calendar turned to 2021, he has just two top 20 finishes in nine starts. His best finish did come in his last start, which was a tie for fourth at the Valero Texas Open, But the other two times he finished top 20 this year, he missed the cut in his next start. He's a staple at this event, Lucas Glover is, and does have a couple good finishes, but that's bound to happen when you've played in this event 18 years. Uh, But he has missed more cuts, seven of them, than he does have top 25s, which he has just five of. He only has one top 10 in all those events. So I like the chances that Grillo is once again in contention here on Sunday, and Glover may not even be around on the weekend. So take Emiliano uh, Grillo over Lucas Glover as your free play this week. Thanks guys for tuning in. Make sure to head over to my page at wagertalk.com to check out this week's complete tournament pack. And as always, good luck with your bets.